friends, Sleepy here. Welcome to a new pick of this video. First off, I have to apologize again for another huge delay in my videos. I think my last one was back in October, so that was like five months ago. I'm very sorry for that. Just been really busy with work and uh, some other stuff. I do plan to film a update vlog video for you guys, let you guys know what's been going on for the past five months with me. I also apologize that I wasn't able to have my Christmas contest. You know, I love having that every year for you guys. And I still actually do plan to do it. It's just going to be really late this year, but... I'll uh, be on the lookout for that vlog video and also be on the lookout uh, for that Christmas contest uh, video. But today we're going to go over all the stuff that I got for Christmas. So these are all Christmas gifts I got. Uh, first two things here I got on eBay and it was with money uh, that I got from my wife. Uh, just like my parents, you know, my wife has a very hard time when it comes to trying to buy games or stuff for my uh, collection. Because my collection is so massive, there's so much stuff, she doesn't know what I have or don't have. So it's just easier for her and my parents to give me gift cards, money, stuff like that, which is completely fine with me because then I can buy the stuff I want. So I found two cool Xbox things on there. Uh, first up here, I got a display only copy for Kung Fu Chaos, which is awesome because these are uh, what were used in like GameStop or other stores like that uh, to display the games before they came out. And they're really tough to find. And this one's like brand new and excellent uh, condition, which is cool. And the seller even popped the game in there for me, which is like brand new. So very awesome. Very happy to uh, have this in the collection. Now, I love collecting variants and stuff. So glad to have this one now. And the other thing I got there was a copy here of NARC. And then this is the variant that doesn't show the 1995 price tag on it. Nothing big, just one I didn't have. So pick that up and it is complete. So that's cool. I uh, got one thing uh, from the Goodwill, and I used some money that my parents gave me. It was five bucks, and it was a GameCube Luigi controller. It's a, one of the Wii ones. You can hook up to a uh, Wii remote. Really cool. Works great. So I used this on my uh, modded Wii. Uh, great to have this. Really cool. I know they have some other, like, Mario's and some other stuff. Uh, it was really neat finding this uh, at a Goodwill. You, know, you can still find some stuff at the thrift stores. You know, it's a lot harder these days. It's not like it used to be. But you can still find stuff. So I was really happy uh, to get this new uh, Luigi controller because it looks really cool. So very happy with that. Now we'll go over stuff I got for my brother. Uh, first up, he gave me this really cool Mario t-shirt. Uh, he found it while he was moving in his stuff. He doesn't even know when he got it. Uh, but he knew I would like it, and I really love it, and it's really awesome. And it's this Nintendo Power Player uh, Mario shirt. Really awesome. So you got this spec when, uh, I believe someone told me in one of my groups that you got this with a Nintendo Power subscription back in the day. And it's in really good condition. He doesn't know where it came from, but hey, he said I could have it for Christmas. So that was awesome. Very happy to add that t-shirt uh, to my collection. I'm gonna hang that up with the uh, rest of my video game shirt. So I'm very, very happy to get this cool Mario shirt. Uh, next up here, I got a big stack of uh, PlayStation 3 and PlayStation 4 games. My brother was purging his collection again and he donated these all to me for Christmas. So first up, we got a one uh, PlayStation 2 game and that was a copy of Mercenaries Playground of Destruction. I already have this game, so this will just be an extra. It's in good condition, and it is complete. Very fun game. Highly recommend uh, playing this uh, on the PlayStation 2. Pick up a copy. Really good game. There's also a sequel on the PS3 and Xbox 360, Mercenaries 2, and that's also a really fun game. Definitely uh, recommend it. Great title, so cool to have another copy there. Now we'll get into the PlayStation 3 games. First up, he gave me a copy of Little Big Planet, and this is the Game of the Year edition, which never owned any of the Little Big Planet games before, but I did uh, play the ones when my brother had them, so it was really cool to get that. And that one's also complete. Next up, uh, Gran Turismo 5, which the Gran Turismo games have always been really cool. I did not have Gran Turismo 5, so it's good to have that now, and it's also complete. White Knight Chronicles, the International Edition. Another uh, series of uh, games here that I did not have, so very happy to have that now. And that one is complete as well. White Knight Chronicles 2, so he also gave me the sequel. So that's really cool. Definitely would like to check these out. They look like they're going to be fun. It is complete. 
So I was glad to get that one as well. Next up, uh, Marvel vs. Capcom 3, Fate of Two Worlds. Can never go wrong with Marvel vs. Capcom games. They're always fun fighters. So I got that one complete. Motorstorm Pacific Rift, which I've heard really good things. I like the Motorstorm series. I did not have this one, so this is definitely another great addition to the collection, and it is also complete. Call of Duty uh, Black Ops, which I like the Call of Duty series. I just mainly play it for the campaigns. I don't really get online and play that stuff. I uh, do have this on the Xbox 360, but now I've got a PS3 version, and it is complete. Next up, I have a copy here of Folklore, which I've seen this many times in the stores. I just never actually picked up a copy ever to play it. So I'm very happy uh, to have this now in the set. So definitely another great game I'll be able to play here soon. And it is complete. Uh, next up now we got the Uncharted series, Uncharted Drake's Fortune, which uh, I have these, but I have the greatest hits version. So now I've got the black label ones. So very happy with that. Cannot go wrong with the Uncharted series. Great games. Highly recommend. If you got a PlayStation, you never uh, pick up this series, definitely pick it up. Great games. Love it. So there's the first one. There's Uncharted 2 Among Thieves. Also complete. And finally, Uncharted 3 Drake's Deception. So very happy to have uh, the Black Label versions in my collection now. Next up, we have uh, Deadly Premonition, the Director's Cut. Now, this is a really odd game. It's like a mixture of an open-world game. Uh, there's driving in it. There's weird puzzles. Uh, just It's just hard to explain. It's just a very unique game. It has many different like genres built into it. I just absolutely love the game. I have the original version on the Xbox 360, but this one on the PS3 is the Director's Cut, so it has extra content and stuff. Love the game. Highly recommend it. Very odd game, but it's fun. So super ex uh, excited to have this in the collection now. So glad to get that. Next up, we have a copy of Untold Legends Dark Kingdom. This is a really cool top-down action RPG, similar to like Boulder's Gate and stuff. And I already have a copy, so I just have an extra one here, which, you know, I'm not going to say no to an extra copy. Another fun game I recommend for the PS3. You can get this dirt cheap. I definitely recommend if you get, like games like Boulder's Gate, the top-down ones, uh, pick this up. Can't go wrong. Very fun game. Next up, I got a copy here of uh, Yakuza 4, which is awesome because I have the first three, and I did not have number four yet, so very happy to have the fourth one in my collection, and it is complete. So Super excited to play this series. I definitely recommend the Yakuza series. Another good game uh, on PlayStation 3. The uh, first two are on PlayStation 2. Definitely recommend. Pick up that series. You'll love it. It's awesome. And I also got uh, Yakuza Dead Souls. So another one in the series. This is Yakuza but with uh, zombies and stuff. I actually never played this one before. So it'll be really cool to check it out. It is also complete. So that's awesome. That's it for the PlayStation 3 games. And now he also donated a bunch of his PlayStation 4 games that he's done with. I don't even have a PlayStation 4 yet. Uh, but now I've got some games for it, so I would like to get one here down the road. I will eventually, so when I do, I'll have some games for it. So first up, copy of Madden 15, you know, nothing special, just a Madden game, but hey, at least I got a Madden game to play on it. Uh, Watch Dogs, which I actually never got around to playing this game yet, so it's kind of, uh, looks like an interesting game. Definitely would like to check it out. I'll have to get it, of course on the 360 or xbox one to play it until i get a ps4 but definitely cool to have that copy of dragon age inquisition which i have this on the i think it's a three i think i have the 360 version i might have it on xbox one i don't remember but uh either way i haven't even just got into the game yet but still cool to get it Next up is NBA 2K14, which I love the NBA uh, 2K series. Always loved them over the years, so there's 2K14. Next up is uh, Middle Earth Shadow of Mordor, and this was the Game of the Year edition, which of course I've been playing my Xbox One version. I beat that uh, last year, and I'm working on Middle Earth Shadow of War right now. Awesome series. Highly recommend it. Get it on the PS4 or the 
Xbox One or PC. Amazing game. Definitely recommend it. Really cool game to get. I don't know, when I get a PS4, I might jump back in and play this one. You never know. A uh, copy of here of uh, Mafia 3, which I recently got the Xbox One version. So, just got an extra one here now for the PS4. It's complete. And the final game he gave me for the PS4 was the Ultimate Evil Edition of Diablo 3 Reaper of Souls, which is awesome. I have this on the uh, Xbox One. Now I've got the PS4 version, so that's really cool. Definitely happy to add all that stuff to my uh, collection. Got a couple more things here for my brother. Some little uh, Mario figures. Uh, first up, he gave me this little toad, which is cool. So I'm going to put him on uh, display up there with my other stuff. So we got this little toad. And then a Mario and Luigi from Burger King toys when they had those. So which is really cool because I missed out on those when they were out. And by the time I got to Burger King to try to get them, they didn't have them anymore. So very happy to have this Mario and Luigi. And then the last thing from him, and this is my favorite gift from him. I've wanted one of these for years and years. And that is an original 1989 Mario doll. It's in really good condition. He got it from one of uh, the local game stores here when he was up here visiting with us. Uh, a collector there donated, well he didn't donate, he sold like $8,000 worth of his Mario Nintendo collection. Because him and his wife wanted a down payment for a house, so he sold part of his collection off uh, to, some, to this local game store here that has many different locations and stuff. And uh, one of the things he had was this Mario uh, doll from 1989. Unfortunately, it's missing a hat, but just to get one of these is amazing. I mean, it's in really good condition, so you can tell, you know, the guy really took care of it. I've always wanted one of these for years. Uh, when I lived in Arizona as a kid growing up in the 90s, there was a, uh, a to Z pawn shop out there that had one of these on display. They would never sell it. They just had it for display. And I always wanted to get one over the years, and I just never got around to getting one so I was so happy when he gave me this really cool stuff very awesome all right guys so that's all the stuff I got for Christmas on my Christmas gifts you know let me know in the comments what did you guys get for Christmas you know I'd love to hear from it I also want to uh, thank you guys for taking the time to watch my videos sticking around with me I promise it's gonna get better we're gonna get back into a regular routine here making videos you know I miss making them I still got to get you guys a room tour. I just got done rearranging the game room slash living room, cleaned everything up. So I'm definitely uh, looking forward to getting uh, that video made. So you look out for a vlog video coming with updates on what's been happening. I'm going to do the Christmas contest still. I still want to do my game room tour and I also want to start doing uh, some more console and collection videos you know i want to do an original xbox collection video for you guys all right take care have a wonderful day and sleep we will definitely see you guys next time